Hi, uh, it's Barnes and Nickel. I am from the future. Um, while I'm editing these, I'm realizing that I probably need to put a trigger warning before these videos. Um, so what you see on screen, and you'll see for a couple more seconds afterwards, is the content and trigger warning that uh, it comes with the game. Um, I just wanted to make sure that everyone was aware before watching these videos because there are some darker things that happen in some of them, um, which is a huge contrast to the kind of whimsical uh, exterior that the game has. So just wanted to put that out there. Um, Hope you keep watching, but if not, I completely understand. There'll be more content, uh, varying content soon. So thank you so much and enjoy the video. Hi folks, it's Barnes and Nickel. We're playing Amori again. So I had some difficulties. Uh, I am re-recording, uh, starting again, um, because we lost some footage here. Um, I played through the game, but it didn't have any audio recording for some reason. Um, and then I accidentally saved over that file with, before realizing that um, I didn't have that footage. So I'll give you a little rundown on what happened. Um, it wasn't a ton, uh, but just so you're caught up in the story. Um, we returned a space boyfriend, returned his uh, mixtape to him to find out that he and Sweetheart have actually uh, broken up. And Kel played the mixtape, enraging Space Boyfriend and leading us to a big fight. Um, afterwards, Space Boyfriend came to his senses, realized that he needed to move on and needed to, and laying in his bed was not going to fix those things. Um, so gave, but did not have any information about Basil for us. Um, so gave us um, some snow cones and some tickets to, to treat ourselves. Um, but currently we have no leads, and so we're going to go searching for Basil now, uh, right here. Um, so he didn't miss much, he just missed a, a big fight, uh, and I'm really sorry about that. Um, but, uh, let's go on with this, uh, this portion of the game. Ready? Cool. We've saved, we're healed up, we've talked to Mari, she didn't give us any extra information, so I guess I'm just going to follow the footprints, because, uh, we'll find another keyboard key we actually found one uh, after the fight with space boyfriend oh he's called captain space boy now um do you see that shadow because i do um sometimes this game will just hit you with stuff that you know is gonna get freaky because i have a uh, sneaking suspicion Like that ringing? Okay. Wait. Why is it just Omori? Okay. Um. So the game is splitting us up. That's cool. Watermelons are my favorite part of summer. Interesting. I don't know why it's disappearing. And it seems really nice and wholesome right now. But I'm worried that it's going to turn not that very quickly. And I saw this up here, so I'm going to go for this first. Because I don't want to follow the shadow. A wish? But what should I wish for? I have everything I could want right here. I have a sneaking suspicion these are like basil memories for a birthday or something that happened recently, or something that happened in the real world with Sunny, because I'm pretty sure that's the real world and this is um, a dream. Ooh, a donut! Are you guys going ahead? Don't worry about us, we'll catch up in a minute. Okay. okay. Mango smoothie. Sounds good. Let's continue this way. Yes, I know that the shadow is down that way. But, if I continue this way, I can get those stuffs before the shadow. Oh. It's up here. You're not supposed to be here. Ooh, there's another water. A can! Right, let's go back down and get that thing first and then come back up here. 
don't want the shadow to get mad at me for going out of order. Okay, bye bye, Shadow. Shadow the Hedgehog. What if that was just Shadow the Hedgehog? Mari's cookies. Mari's cookies have been. have so much love baked into them, I could eat them forever. They sound like my mom's cookies, which are the best. Here we go. Let's continue down this way. Ooh, what's down here? Hey, hello, Shadow the Hedgehog. Again. We're still young. We should drink big, right? Yeah. We should. Leave me alone, Shadow. Go get your guns and your skates and sk skate somewhere else. Uh, I'll come back to that. Is there anything else this way? Ooh, some presents. Looks like the end of the map of the Okay, well, fine. We'll come back to both of these things. Because I do want to see what Shadow wants to show me. This year you get just one present from all of us. That looks like it's like a like a violin or a musical instrument. It looks like a music case. Um, it'd be really cool if we find Basil and we get him and he has like music skills. That would be really cool. Oh yeah, Kel got a really new skill that I wanted to check out but I forgot to. Okay. If we ever get them back. The fact that this is a barn and the light is glowing is troublesome. Okay, so it's a big picture. Okay, but the light is glowing like it wasn't... Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Exactly what I expected. Some spooky. And there's no music. Okay. About to get dark. Sheet music on a music stand. All the notes have been scribbled out. A happy family. Not anymore. Cool, I'm gonna leave. I see you, Space Go. Oh, what? Well, uh. Did you see that flash of basil? I I don't know what it is about horror like this, but it just freaks me out. I watch scary movies, read scary books. Yes, I hi cat, hi cat, hi cat. Um, and like I I it doesn't phase me, but this stuff, however, really just makes my s skin crawl. Um, Let's check our notebook like we always do. Yeah, have any of the pages changed? Nope, I still think that one's really cool. I don't know why that cat is raining blood. Uh, nope, 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 nope. Spooky ghost thing. What do the tissues say? Cool.
can't catch me, you can't catch me. Um, okay. Not 100% sure what I should be doing here. I guess let's check the light bulb. I don't like the heartbeat. It makes me stressed. Yeah, let's look at the light bulb. Is that... It's pitch black inside, you can't see. Okay. I've checked everything. I don't want to catch those hands. I do not want to catch those hands. Was I supposed to find more keys before this? Like, I guess I'm gonna run. Oh god, I hate to this. My hands caught me. Okay, let's check the computer one more time. Does it only take me here? Oh! Between giant pinwheels! All of these are where they are! Okay. We gotta do it again. I forgot that that's what happened last time. Here we go, folks. Um, you might want to look away, because I don't like doing this either. Here we go. Real world time. At the time, I saw everything. Oh no. When you stood here before, did you see it too? Something behind you. There's nothing behind me. I know that there is not. Three days left. Um, excuse me, uh, sir, uh, three days till what? Three days till what, sir? Um, three days till what? Okay, we're back with Sunny. Do you have a map? Do you have a key thing? You don't. Cool. Let's talk to the phone. You have a new message. Hey, Sunny, it's Mommy. How are you doing? Are you eating well? Why wouldn't you know that? I was hoping that I could come make it back to see you today, but this is the last day of the big furniture sale, and I can't resist a good bargain. You can take care of yourself for a few days, right? After all, you're a big boy now. Remember to finish your chores before I get back. I left a list on the table next to your door. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Bzzzt. I'm not going to do any of these chores. Mom's to-do list. You don't feel like doing chores right now. Yeah, I'm not going to do any of those chores. Old computer. Do you want to play blackjack? Is there a mini game? Blackjack? 25. Hit me. Stay. Ah. Uh, I, okay. Hit. Stay. Tie. Look at those sharks. Okay, I'm quitting. I have $75. Cool. Quit. I'm sure there's something for playing that, but I don't want to waste your time for playing that. Because I want to keep going with the story, man. Not this shit again. What's in this door? Nope. Okay. 
Who is it? What do you want? Hello? Hello? Sunny? Are you there? Do you remember me? It's your old friend, Kel! I didn't know what voice to do. I'm sorry. Here we go. So I, uh... I noticed the for sale sign in front of your house, and I, uh, um... Heard from your mom that you're moving away soon. I was wondering if you wanted to hang out one more time before you go or whatever. F for old time's sake, you know? Do it, Omori. Sunny. The same person. Do it. Oh. It's the camera thing. Open the door. I forget. I thought he had... Fucked off to another room. God. Whoa, Kel is tall now. Look at him. Same old Kel, though. It's so bright and vibrant and like saturated rather than the pastelli of the other. Um, it's cool. Wow, you actually came out. Uh, uh, I, I mean, okay, I'm gonna be honest with you, Sunny. I really didn't expect you to come out today, so I, I, I don't really have a game plan here. Hey, I know. Let's go to Hobies. Hobbies? It's the hobby shop in Faraway Plaza. Hobbies. I was close. You remember the way, right? We used to go there all the time when we were kids. Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Cool. Equip. I still have a knife. I don't like that he has a knife. Kel has a basketball. He did look like a basketball player. Hector! Do I have anything else with me? Skills. Calm down and guard. He's got encourage. Oh, this is so cool. There's so... Clearly something happened in the real life to... To Basil. Um, classy white mailbox. Look at those. Oh, you shouldn't walk in the street, Sunny. That's dangerous. Um. Ooh, look at the doggy. Wait, hold up, Sonny. I know it's been a while since you've been over at my place, but now might be not be a good time. I just want to say hi to your dog, dude. Whose place is this? Is it Aubrey's? There's no response. An empty birdhouse filled with sticks and dust. That's your religious figure. You feel as if it is judging you. Yep, that, that scans. So I think something happened to Basil in real life that has affected these kids. Um, so much so that Omori f and his mom felt the need to move. Far away park. The future belongs to the dreamers. Ooh, look at that. Soda. Soda, soda, soda. A vending machine. Preacher. I'm on my way to church, but it's a ritual of mine to take a quick stroll before my sermons. Had horrible stage fright ever since I was a child, and seeing Quok always seems to calm my nerves. How, how is this creature existing? Are these just, like, children? Where did it go? I'm sorry, what? I'm sorry, what? A teddy bear. I'm sorry, who? Jungle Jim. Smells like rusty metal, but I want to play with that cat. An orange cat. Looks hungry. Feed it some fish? I don't have any fish. Let's go get some fish for this cat. Using all my sense for this cat. Who's this? There's a homeless man, it looks like. 
Olive Beanie. When I was younger, my family used to go to a park a lot. I remember being a lake and a statue. But I can't find it anywhere. Old Hobo. Oh, hello. <clears throat> ah, today is such a beautiful day, don't you think? I might not have any money, but at least sunlight is free. I'm sorry, bud. So I'm not experiencing homelessness. That's sad. Empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Yes. We are going to save, and we're going to save in this file, just in case. But everything seems to be going okay for him. Okay. I can pick up the trash, because I'm the trash man. No, because uh, it is uh, good for the environment. Life has been kind of stressful lately, but people watching helps me put things into perspective. I might make it a habit and come to this park more often. I guess sometimes all it takes is relax and just stop and smell the roses. I don't know what that was. Hello, youngins. I don't know if you've been watching where you're stepping, but there's quite a lot of trash around this town. If you happen to find any, can you bleed it to me to dispose of properly? Come on, youngins, let's help the world one step at a time. Well, lady, I got some trash for you. Thank you for the two dollars. An artist diligently sketches. Whoa, that's a cool drawing of the park you have there. Ah, oh, oh, uh, hi there. Uh, th thank you. I'm just, just practicing. That's what you call practicing, but it looks so real. I bet you could even sell that for money. Don't you think so, Sonny? See? Even Sonny agrees with me. Heck, I'd buy it from you right now. Hey, Sonny, can you lend me twenty dollars? Haha, <laughs> that's so nice of you, but it's not for sale. It, it's it's for my portfolio. I'm trying to get into art school next year. Ah, oh, darn, that's too bad. That would have looked great on my bedroom wall. Uh, you, you really think so? My name is Mincy. What's yours? I'm Kel, and this is Sonny. H Hi, Kel and Sonny. It's nice to meet both of you. It's nice to meet you too, Mincy. What's, what's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. You're just the first person to say something positive about my drawings. Sometimes when I'm feeling down, it makes me question myself, and it gets hard to move my pencil. No way. I don't believe that at all. I really think your drawing is great. I wouldn't be able to do that in a million years. So don't be so hard on yourself, Mincy. Me and Sunny believe in you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. I just gotta shake off those bad feelings. I'll... I'll try to buckle down and finish this for now. That's the spirit. See you around, Mincy. You got this. Look at Cal being all nice and positive. Why are you smelling these poles? Man. Hello, sir. I would like to pick up that trash. You look like you smell. The stench of the man is indescribable. What you making that face for, bub? There's something on my face. Don't want to fight you. Um, basketball dude, come back. Blocked. Oh, hey, what's up? What are you doing here, Kel? You from around this part of town? Oh, whoa, I didn't expect to see you here, Jay. Sonny, this is Jay. He's the captain of the football team at my high school. I didn't know you played basketball, too. <sighs> I'm just here to kill time. It's more of a hobby more than anything. You trained out for the basketball team this year, right, Kel? Maybe you can teach me some of your tricks. Yeah, definitely. That sounds like fun, but maybe another time. My childhood friend Sonny here is leaving for town the next few days, so we're hanging out all day today. I'll definitely catch up with you later, though. Sure, we can set up something next week. Same time, same place? Yep, sounds good. See you then. I'll get out of your way. What are these? Rec Recyclists? Follower? Oh, you have littered. They are reduce, reuse, and recycle. Okay, so there's a cult of recycling. Interesting. Okie dokie. I guess I just need to leave the park now. Ooh. Okay. That, right up there, up top of the building, that is Space Captain Space Boy. Hello, Captain Space Boy. I'm sorry that I made the people miss you. Are you the mascot for hobbies? 
Oh, come on, Sunny, let's go to hobbies first. Well, here we are at hobbies. It's probably been a while since you since you were here, but it hasn't really changed all that much. It's all the same old stuff. Captain Space Boy games, sweetheart movies, and a few pet rocks. Except now they're vintage. Actually, since we're here, I should probably buy a gift for Hero. He's in college right now, but he should be coming back sometime tomorrow. He's studying to be a doctor, so maybe I should buy him... some medicine? So they're all in high school. I think something happened. Yep. No, that's a horrible idea. You should help me pick out a gift, Sonny. Let's look around and see what there is. Colorful CDs. The CD looks pretty cool, but I think Hero would appreciate something more sentimental. Let's keep looking. Super Ultra Sprout Molt Eater Revenge of the Moles 3. Rated M for Mature, huh? That's too violent for Hero. He definitely won't appreciate something like that. Chock full of DVDs. A lot of these DVDs are catchy dust. I'm sure we have most of these somewhere at home already. Probably also catchy dust. Cardboard cutout of Captain Spaceboy. A bunch of small figures. I've always been fond of these slow guys. Hero would get mad at me for spending my lunch money on them, though. Let's not remind him of that. This, yes, this is perfect. Papa Chips chip off the old block cookbook. Wow, that's a mouthful. Hero had a copy of this when we were kids, but our dog Hector destroyed it. He's going to be so happy when he sees this. But before that, we need to ask the most important question. How much does it cost? Twenty dollars! This is extortion. Shoot. I left my wallet at home. Er, can you spot me, Sonny? I promise I'll pay you back. Thanks, friend. I knew I could count on you. You took Hero's gift off the shelf. Do I even have $20? Oh, I have $32. Cool. Hey, shopkeeper, we'd like to buy this cookbook, please. Hey, Kel, how you been, buddy? It's been a while since you come around, hasn't it? Ah, that's Papa Chips out the chip off the old block cookbook. I see you have good taste. Yeah, my brother used to follow his recipes all the time. His cookies were my favorite. That's rare to see another fan of Papa Chip's work. That'll be $20, please. Thank you, kind sirs. Please enjoy. You got Hero's gift. Thanks a lot, Sonny. I bet Hero will love this. So, where do you want to go now, Sonny? Guess there's really not much around the suburbs, huh? How about Faraway Park? Yeah, the park! We passed it on the way here. Sounds fun, doesn't it? Yo! I'm Michael, the soon-to-be traveling musician. I've been playing guitar here in the town plaza for years, but now I think I'm finally ready to move on. Will you help me reach my goal? Anything would be helpful. Here's one dollar for the guitar guy. Hmm. Looks like I still have quite a pro before I can refuse to leave town. Thank you and return I'll play you an original song. This is the guy from the other episode.
it's Gino's. It's a pizzeria. We'll probably come back here, so I'm gonna... Other mark. Drink orange juice. Have you ever heard the phrase, orange juice is the happiest color? No? Well, that's fine. Just know it's the same concept applies to orange juice as vitamin C, which is essential for healthy immune system functions. It's also an antioxidant, and they have health benefits by protecting your cells from radical damage. So would you like to buy some orange juice for two dollars? No. As long as you don't buy any apple juice, I don't care. This person sucks at parking. Let's go pick up all the trash. Look at this garden center. Is that who I think it is? Seashell. That was Mari and Basil. Sleeping right now. It's a nice little garden center, except for the ghosts. Also got bumping music, man. These two ghosts? They're not ghosts. They're just in love. After all this time, we finally moved in together. Isn't it so exciting, Sean? Yeah, it's the start of the rest of our lives. Now it's time to make our first important decision. What color should we paint our house walls? Hmm, I think anything would work. I like all the colors. What do you think, Sean? I could go anyway too. Don't worry about me. You can choose, Karen. What color would you like? Oh, Sean, you're too selfless. I don't need to pick the a wall color. Be happy with anything as long as I'm with you. Karen, if we keep doing this, we're going to be stuck here forever. You're right. What if we just close our eyes and pick a color? Oh, that works. That way the results will be completely impartial. Let's do that. Okay, sounds good. Close your eyes, Karen. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. It's okay. You should be the one to do it, Sean. I insist. No, Karen. It should definitely be you. What if I pick a color you don't like? We're not getting anything done here, are we? <sighs> I have an idea. Let's get a stranger to help us. Hey, you. Could you help us out for a second? Please come here and pick a color sample. Just make sure it's completely random. Picked up a floral wallpaper sample. Huh. What wallpaper doing here in the paint section? Guess it must have gotten mixed place. Well, it's not really what I was expecting, but I'm kind of digging it. What do you think, Karen? The wallpaper seems neat. I think this would work just fine. Let's do it. Thank you so much for your help. We're both from around the area. We just moved in together in a brand new house recently. The one with the yellow roof on the street near the church. Thinking of having a housewarming party two days from now. It would be amazing if you could join us. Okay, I'm gonna keep that in my noggin. Because I think the three days left means three days before he moves. So we have today, tomorrow, the day after, and then we move the next day. Let's go get more trash. Because there's trash. Uh-oh. It looks like there was a biker gang there. It's the worm. Hi! Meow. Meow to you too. Okay, so there's a bunch of houses. It's an artist. Oh, hello. Hey, stranger. You're just in time to critique my latest work in progress. Oh, I didn't mean to do this. Oh, hi, doggy. Hello, doggy. Bark, 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 bark. Lucas, quit your yapping. Look at this sketch for me. What do you think? The drawing looks too stiff. 
I thought so. It's all coming to me now. Inspiration has stricketh. And voila! It looks so much better. Cool. Glad I can help you with that. But I had planned on doing it. We're not going to any more houses right now. Cool. Um, you know, I think we'll stop this one here. Because I have a feeling once we get to the park, uh, something bigger is going to happen. So um, we'll stop this one here. Uh, and we will go back to the park the first thing in the next episode. So thank you so much for watching. Um, if you liked what you saw, please subscribe, like the video, uh, leave a comment, share it with a friend, whatever you feel like. Um, there will definitely be more of these because I'm really digging this game. Um, so thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.